In this video, let's look on different types of projects. The projects are categorized on the basis of certain criteria like the invoicing policy they had chosen or depending on the timesheet updation or it may consider whether the project contain a task or not. There are mainly four types of projects including timesheet projects, nota spawn projects, non-buildable project and fixer project. So let's discuss each of them. Let's go to our project module and under the project overview you can see certain features like build down timesheets at a fixer price and non-billable task. These are three refers types of projects. Now let's discuss about timesheet project. Timesheet projects are invoiced with a reference to the timesheet hours. So first of all we have to create a sale order. So this is our demo project and we have in any task. For this demo project we have to create a task from a sale order. So go to our sales module and create a sale order. Click on create button. You can add a customer and add your service product. Before confirming uh, the sale order, you have to check the configuration of the service product. With the help of the external link, you can check that. And the product type should be service. And under sales tab, you have to check the invoicing policy. That is, the invoicing policy should be chosen as timesheet on task because the timesheet projects are invoiced based on the timesheet hours. And service tracking should be create a task in an existing project. And you have to mention the project over here. It is our demo project and click on save. And confirm the sale order. So on confirming you can see a task is created inside the project. Now go to the task and update the timesheet so when you are checking the timesheet you can see the plan hours is 1 because we have order for a unit quantity you can add a line you can add the employee timesheet who has just a for just half an hour 30 minutes so you can see the progress as 50 percentage now create a sale order for this service product so click on the sale order you can see that the delivered quantity as 0.5 that is half of the quantity that is 50 percentage now check the project overview Click on overview, you can see the hours recorded as 30 and the percentage rate is 100. So you can see the timesheet cost as 50 because uh, uh, for this timesheet project, the invoice based on the timesheet cost of the employee that is uh, the product of the delivered quantity and product sales price. The next kind of project is fixer project. So for fixer project, they are invoiced based on the ordered quantity. So for this also, we have to create a sale order first. So create on. Add a customer. And add the service product. Also using the external link, you can change the configuration of the service product. That is product type should be sales. And under sales, the service invoicing policy should be ordered quantity. Because this kind of that is fixer project is based on the ordered quantity. And service tracking is create a task in an existing project itself. And 
the project is over here click on save and confirm now check on the project overview you can see build at fixer price is 140 that is this amount is based on the ordered quantity now the next type of the project is no task font project so in case of the non-task uh, font project the project does not contain tasks and the overview is based on the timesheet cost of the employee so again go to project module so for this project demo 01 we have in any task so go to overview so nothing is updated and you can enter the timesheet course create a description as tested mention the project and uh, timesheet cost is so duration is 30 hours now check your overview so you can see a notice found that is uh, 30 and the percentage rate is 100 so the time uh, timesheet cost will be the product of the hours spent and the timesheet cost of the employee next type of project is non billable project so for non billable project has a uh, task and uh, task gets updated in the timesheet how it doesn't create any sale order now for this project demo 02 create a task as task 1 and uh, update the timesheet for this task click on edit under timesheet you can add plan hours I'm adding as plan hours is 100 and one of the employee Michelle admin who has supervised for 70 hours click on save so you can see the progression is 70 percentage now check the project overview for demo 02 so you can see the non billable hours is 70 and updated percentage rate is project found to be 100 percentage this is the timesheet cost is updated at 7000 if we create a sale order for this project so we are creating and add a customer and you are adding a service you can build at project rate or employee rate so at project rate is 100 and create a, a sale order by clicking the create sales order here you can see the delivered quantity has 70 at the unit price of 100 and create invoice the invoice is created and posted now click on overview you can see the non billable task here it is updated as zero and over here that is that is be based on timesheet does the non billable project hours get changed depending on the invoicing quantity and the invoiced hours gets updated in the timesheet also you can see this so this is all about types of projects if you are interested in knowing more about this or looking for any odoo implementation or customization in your business 
drop your request to info at cybrosis.com.